so look what we got here our first official story time what's up guys josiah master 75 you're back again with another video for you guys today i'm going to be telling you how panda express has almost killed me so here we go so i we i was at work right this was before so i'm gonna tell you what happened before so we were back you know i was just relaxing chilling at work right and i got yelled at by a girl for i couldn't get her a happy meal she was like can i get a happy meal please i was like no we don't serve until 11. she's like can i get a happy meal please i was like what how you gonna get mad at me i get my things to my manager right you know this chilling all day and now you already know like it's just chill bro you know then a dude comes up to my manager and was like we should fight like y'all gonna knock you out I was, I was in the bathroom i went to the bathroom afterwards i was like hold up what's going on and i was like for real these men trying to fight or over us a, a mcdouble a mcdouble bro you finna fight my manager off a mcdouble well can we just give you for free but you act for more money than papa that that's so stupid then you know a couple hours passed you know we was just chilling you know just chilling i was in the car right we drive all the way down to South St. Paul. And then we see Panda Express. And we see Buffalo Wild Wings. We see, uh, what's it ever called? Like McDonald's and other food places, right? I was like, dang, I'm kind of hungry. Let me get some Panda Express. This is my first time ever having it. So, you know, me being the boy I am, got that money. Tell my mom, hey, mom, I think she dropped me off at your pool. Um, oh, you should go to Panda Express. This line long? That thing all we go back to all the way to the driveway. Can you believe that? Like, come on now. That long for some Panda Express? This felt better be hidden. So I finally get my food, I get some chow mein, I get some white rice, get some more chicken. And then, you know, you know, you know, just 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 smashing on that. Just smashing. You know, I was eating my food, got dark a little bit of my Fanta. On um, strawberry fancy, you know, but I started it. The fan didn't have no like flavor, it was just plain, plain, just I don't know what it was like bubbly water, but yeah. So then, on top of that, I started feeling a pain in my left piece of my jaw, right? I was like, Mom, I like my throat started, like, I couldn't swallow, right? I was like, I was like, spitting, I was like, <laughs> I spit and stuff, you know. Cause like I couldn't swallow cause like my thing was closing up bro. Like I started couldn't breathe. My mom was like, hey, are you okay? So I just are you okay? You know, then I have to, you know, call the paramedics, right? We asked the people if they had peanut oil in the food. The lady said no. Multiple people said no. They didn't offer me a refund. Can you believe that? They didn't even ask me no refund. All I said was sorry, you guys could have killed me. If y'all really think about it, you guys could have really killed me. I could have been laid out on the grass. I could have been six feet below right now, bro. I couldn't even be here today if, it, if I wouldn't even be. I would if I my mom did not call the cops. That ambulance hit me. I would not be here today. You guys could have killed me. I could have been six feet under because you guys, bro. Can you believe that? Like I, this could be, that two weeks ago, three weeks ago, could have been my last last day on this earth, bro. You guys need to start looking out for what you guys are eating. Cause that could I almost I could have died that day, bro. I might not sound like stupid, like people getting their arms cut off by 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 sharks and stuff. I I bro. I couldn't breathe, bro. You know how painful that is? Like not being able to breathe, bro. I had to get an EpiPen shot with her on top of that. Like honestly, bro. As soon as you stick it in your thigh, bro, you're going to feel that. A couple minutes later, you're going to feel that. I saw it's going to hurt. I was like, oh. like be like this. They gave me the better drill the arm, you know, gave me a little couple shots. But still, I look back. I did not I ended up falling asleep on the ambulance. Ambulance thought I was dead. They thought I like passed out. And then I was scared, bro. I was like, I could still have a little reaction thinking upon him that because I digest the food. But nothing has happened since then. Then I had to go to the paramedic and wasted three hours of my life. I could have been at home, smashing. I could have, I could have saved some money, bro. But nah, I had to waste my money on chip. I mean, 
Panda Express. You know what? I'm never eating from you guys again. I could have been six feet under. I'm going to say that one more time. I could have been six feet under. I could be in a tomb so my family cry because of you guys. This might sound like dramatic and all. But like still, you guys, why'd you have to? If you didn't know, you could just say, I don't know. That wouldn't have bought it. Taking the vet. Like that's all I needed to know. Like honestly. But no. I had to witness this pain, this pain and suffering. I never expected to feel over some food. Some food. I ain't getting no refund. We're going. I don't know. I got to watch some Bigfoot, you know, everything was cheery afterwards. Got some nasty Chipotle. I thought Chipotle, Chipotle should be good. I might have finna lie to you. But after I got that that one day, disgusting. So, no Panda Express, no Chipotle, or Smash Burger. Three nastiest places on this earth. I don't want to hear it. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the story time. If what traumatic experiences come up, I'll hop on the story time route. Remember to subscribe, like, turn on notifications, become one of the masters of peace. I'll see y'all next time. You've never seen Rocky.